Salut, c'est Géraldine. Welcome chez Comme une Française TV, Live in France, feel at home. In January, France slowly gets back to work after a two-week break. Every French person talks about their Christmas family dinner and their New Year's Eve gueule de bois. It's a hangover, gueule de bois. But what nobody tells you is that after Christmas traditions come a few January traditions. Two of these can lead you to a culture faux pas that may cost you all year long. What are they? This is what we'll see now. So you can start this year du bon pied. Start off the right foot. Bonne année. Always start with a bonne année. Bonne année is the first thing you have to say to your friends, colleagues and family when you talk to them for the first time in January and all January long. In France, you have one month to souhaiter la bonne année. Souhaiter la bonne année is wish a happy new year. Note. This is as important as saying bonjour first thing in the morning and only once to people you meet. Saying bonne année applies to all first communications of the year, so it can be used as a greeting when you are talking, texting, emailing, calling, anything. In an email, for example, you would use salut, bonne année, and then you start the conversation. Salut, bonne année, and then the email stopped. On the phone, for example, salut Julie, ça va? Bonne année vu qu'on ne s'est pas encore croisé. Bonne année vu qu'on ne s'est pas encore croisé. Se croiser is to meet, ok? To a colleague, it will be more formal. Bonjour Jean, tous mes voeux pour cette nouvelle année. Tous mes voeux pour cette nouvelle année. Best wishes for this new year. Christmas cards are not so common in France. People and companies will send a card saying bonne année rather than joyeux Noël, but they're both called carte de vœux, carte de vœux. Avoid the culture faux pas of forgetting les étrennes, les étrennes. Les étrennes are a certain amount of money offered as a new year gift. It can be given inside a family, for a, from a grandparent to a child, for example. But when we usually talk about les étrennes, it's between adults, and we are referring to the money we give to le concierge, or le gardien, the janitor, le concierge ou le gardien, la femme de ménage, la femme de ménage, the housekeeper, les pompiers, the firemen, les pompiers, les éboueurs, les éboueurs, the bin men or the garbage collectors. This is an extra to thank them for all their hard work all year long. Les pompiers, le facteur, les éboueurs, sell their calendar, calendrier, le calendrier, door to door from mid-December to mid-January. It's up to you whether you want to buy it or not and the amount you want to give them. If you have a cleaning lady in your building or a concierge or a janitor, you can ask your neighbors about the us et coutume. Us et coutume, it's a habits and customs concerning les étrennes. That's the best way to do it. Et toi? Your French will improve only if you take action by using what you learn on Commune Française TV. Wish a bonne année in French and tell us how it went. By email, on the phone or in person, everything works. The comment section is the best area to start discussions and ask questions. Would you like to receive exclusive content from Commune Française? Subscribe to Commune Française to receive my exclusive tips on real friends every Tuesday plus an exclusive video lesson. Present yourself in French, it's free. Merci for watching Commune Française TV. Live in France, feel at home. Et bonne année. Allez, salut!